Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be going over how to install Pokemon Infinite Fusion pre-packaged with all of the game files and all of the sprites. You might want to use these files if you're having download issues with the installer, you're not able to connect to the sprite repo, or you might have downloaded the fake files from a fake website claiming that they were the official website and you need a version that will help you fix any of the issues that you're seeing. I do want to preface that I am part of the staff for Pokemon Infinite Fusion, so this is an official guide for the game. I know there's a lot of YouTubers out there with tutorials that are pointing to the wrong location to install this game and even using the fake website to install this game. This is an official guide, so you can trust the files I'm going to be giving you because this is going to be a big download because you're downloading the full game and all of the sprites, so that you are going to need 3 gigs of space. Now. What I'm going to be providing in the description of the video is this. I'm going to provide a link to WinRAR because you are going to need a tool like WinRAR or 7-Zip to extract these files because they are 3 gigs. You will also see a file for Mediafire and another one for Google Drive. These are both the same file. I just know some people pre prefer Google Drive over Mediafire and vice versa. So that's why I provided two links for you to download, but you just need to install one of them. So go ahead and get the link for Google Drive, for example. And let's search for that, and you will get the RAR file for the latest version of the game. This game is constantly evolving, so it might not be 6.0.5 at the time of you are watching this video, but I am updating these files consistently, so that they'll always be up to date. I will also show you how to update your files if they, for whatever reason they are older, but I promise you I am updating these files. So go ahead and click on download anyway and it'll start downloading. Next, go to the WinRAR link and go ahead and install WinRAR. I'm not gonna go through the installation of this because it's pretty simple, just download it and install it, but you should have WinRAR installed on your machine as well. Once you have those things downloaded and installed, right click on the RAR file and using WinRAR, go ahead and hit Extract To. And this will start extracting to a folder of that same name. This might take a while depending on your machine. Like I said, it's almost three gigs, but just give it some time. Once that's done extracting, you are actually done. Go ahead and open it. You'll get the Infinite Fusion folder. Open it and you have every single file for the game and all of the sprites already sorted for you for the game. All you need to do is double click on game and you are good to go and the game will open. If you are interested in playing the preloaded game for this game, which means that you wanna play offline, or you're having performance issues with using game.exe because your internet is slow or it's not stable, use game-preloaded. From the in-game settings, turn off download sprites and that'll fix your issues. This is the most optimized version of the game. It does take longer to open the game because it's preloading all of the sprites before you get into the game, but it should have better in-game speed. Next thing I'm gonna show you is where your save files are. In your game folder, there's a save file shortcut that'll take you to your save file location. So if you have a prior save, go ahead and move it to this folder and it'll load it up for you once you play the game. The last thing I'm going to cover is cheats. So I am heavily discouraging cheats because I am part of the staff for the game, but if people need to enable cheats, I will leave the instructions in the description. I'm not going to go over it in the tutorial because as I mentioned, I'm strongly discouraging it but I understand cases where you wanna play with friends, you wanna play with the same teams, you wanna have your Pokemon to a certain level. So I'm gonna leave the instructions in there. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments or in Discord and I'll help you out. I'll talk to you guys later, see ya.